I'm Vinu Keller. Welcome to Vinu Inspires. It's time to give your children a childhood they won't have to heal from. Welcome to Wednesday Wisdom. Today, I wanted to talk about how kids feel when we sometimes overreact to things. So for our kids, when they're coming to us with something, sometimes it's not a big deal to them. And when they tell us as a parent, because we're in a parent mind, we sometimes can overreact. Maybe it's our facial expressions with I'm very guilty of. And sometimes it's our tonality. Sometimes it's the force of our, our voice, like how we come across. And when we act like that with our kids, they stop to trust us a lot of times because immediately their brain goes into judgment. It's like, if I come to mom and dad and I tell them this and they're like, oh, I can't believe this or what, all of a sudden they go into, oh, I can't trust them. They're going to judge me. What we want as parents is to create that open, safe, and trusting space with them where they can talk to us. Remember, we may think our kids tell us everything, but I am here to tell you, they don't tell us everything. They tell us maybe a lot of it, majority of it, or what we think is is everything. I know I've had that with my older boys. Like I thought they told me everything until I found out that they did it. If we can create that open and safe and trusting space for them, where we're not overreacting, where we can actually give them the support that they're looking for, they will tend to tell us more. Matter of fact, we'll be that confident for them. We'll be that person that they can come to and trust because we're not going to judge them. We're going to hear them with an open mind. Remember what I always say, be curious, not critical. That also means that when they're telling us something, Check in with your tone, check in with how you're responding. Are you being curious? Is your posture curious? Is your facial expression curious? Or is it more critical? Do whatever it takes to help your kids understand that you're there to love them, to support them, to hear them. And when you do that, we stop overreacting and our kids start to feel that they can trust us and that they can come to us with anything, whether small or big. That's my tip for Wednesday Wisdom, and I'll see you next week.